We've just arrived in Hartlepool. Julie is 13 years old and has been travelling with the circus since she was four. Whoa, Julie, you're really good. Thank you. That is kind of scary looking. How high is it? It's eight metres. So when you're up there, do you feel scared? Only when I was doing one trick. I climbed and I was supposed to fall forwards, but then I was like, what if I fall? So I did it slow and then I was like, oh, that's not bad, so I did it fast. So who taught you in the first place? My grandma taught me. So do you reckon that you could teach me, like, I don't know, just have a little go, just dangle off the end, something easy? Yeah, you could, but you have to try to climb it a bit. Stand up, open them, stand, and then start spinning. One, two, Wow. You must have such strong arms then. <laughs> to pull your, let's pull your muscle. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm such a wimp. Oh my gosh! I'm not as agile as I used to be. Straighten your leg out. Okay. <laughs> Straightening my leg out. Get your leg up here. Up there. Twist your leg. She's a good coach. Quite strict. Oh. Yeah, there. Yeah? Yeah. Okay, ready? One, two, two three. three. Oh. No, we haven't got enough slack. You're too low. Stand. Flat. Yeah, just oh my gosh! Ah! Yeah, just open them, hold them separately. Oh no, don't. Okay. Okay, go in. Yes. Go. Huh? Go in. I'm in. Okay, get your leg I'm out. I'm tangled. Get this leg out. Okay, out. Oh, yeah. And now we'll do it again. Push. Uh, push with your leg here. Oh my gosh! Ah! Yes. And twist again. Uh. Ow! Okay, go. So what is it like, guys, living with a travelling circus? It's fun. Yeah. I like that I can practice. Mm -hmm. And then, like, when you go out of the cabin, there's no, like, rules, so you can play. Oh, yeah, you've got lots of land around. It's like having a big garden. Yeah. So you guys aren't actually in the show. What do you do when the show's on? Well, we just, like, hang around or play. And are your parents in the show, then? Yeah. I'm starting to learn what my mum and dad do German with. Really? I can spin it, but I can't spin their one because it's a bit too big for me. Okay, the show is just finishing now, and everyone is coming out. <laughs> now they're going to be doing cool down. That is our stage where we practice, but now they're taking it down. We have just arrived on our ground. And Kimberly's traveling with me today. Hi. And my bird, Sweetie. Yeah, she likes to sit on the belt. What about school? Is it tricky to do school and have to travel about yeah. everywhere? No, yeah. for me, I'm fine with school. I'm right. not nervous. Because I've been to loads of high schools all by myself already. My name's Mr. Wing. I'm the head teacher. Hi. 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 You must be coming for a few days, is that right? Yeah. Till Friday. Yeah. That's fine, yeah. When I go to a different school, I make new friends, so... So you get to make more friends than the average person. Yeah. Be very popular. Yeah, yeah. and you have friends in all different I towns know. and cities. I know. We're now in Julie's home and we've got a very special guest, Julie's glamorous granny from the Ukraine. Can you ask your grandmother whether you make a good student? Yeah, Okay, she said, yes, I'm a very good student because I always um, keep practicing. Like she said, okay, you've done it three times. I'm like, no, I need to do more. I need to keep practicing. And she said she feels very proud. Ah, oh, you're the best student then, huh? Yeah. Perfectionist. And do you reckon your grandma could give us a sample of something that she does, a yeah. trick perhaps? Because she's a chask. <laughs> okay. Okay? <laughs> yeah. Wow! Woo! Amazing! <laughs> Woo. Impressive granny! Very good! <laughs> now Julie, I have had such a good day hanging out with you and your friends. It's been a real laugh, hasn't it? Yeah. And to say thank you, I've got a little something for you. A blue Peter bird, so I'll just pin it on there. Excellent, thank you so much. Thank you.